Today will be an installation demonstration on uh, cabin filter with activated charcoal for the Tesla Model 3. Uh, I will put a link in the description below to this product specifically, uh, but this is all about how to access and where to put them if you want to do it yourself, which will save you a lot of money. The first two steps are the easiest. First, you want to bring back your passenger seat far enough to access the floor mat and that should be good there. And then I'm gonna take out my floor mat. And what I suggest is use your floor mat as uh, a place to kneel down to uh, save your knees because you will be on your knees when you're gonna be doing the install process. Probably wanna use something, if not this, something softer for your knees. This is what they look like. They're two identical. Got this honeycomb design. And of course, details on all of this will be uh, in the description below. It comes with detail installation steps one through nine. So I'm gonna follow that and install them. It comes with two tools, which you will definitely need. Step one, take the front passenger floor mat out. I've done that. Then slide the seat backwards. I've done that. Then I'll find four latches uh, on a cover underneath the glove box. I'll gently pull back and remove that cover using this tool right here. So this is what you're gonna be taking out when you use the tool. Next up, using a screwdriver, press down the lock buttons of the ambient light, which allow you to then pull out the connecting wire of the light simultaneously. Using a screwdriver, unscrew the two screws on the side of the speaker, set the lower cover of the glove box aside and they provided this tool for that. So those are the two screws that um, released the speaker. The next step is to carefully remove the inner trim panel starting from the front of the car using a little force and then pulling off the baffle. Okay, now that's off. Next up, it says follow the orange cable to its highest point and then use the uh, torque screwdriver, removing the hexagon socket screw from the air filter box cover. That's his highest point, there's no. Once you take the orange off, it's really hard to find, but you have to really get up there and you'll see the screw, it's really high. I'm gonna unscrew it and do my best to show you what it looks like. The screw head is just up in the distance. I'm using the light off my iPhone actually to show you. Uh, it's kind of hard to see from any other angle, so I'm taking the camera off the tripod to show you, but that's way up there. That's where it is. Okay, finally got the screw out. So now I should be able to pop out this door to access all that for that. All right. Since I just got my Tesla two months ago, I don't need to replace this air filter, so I'm not gonna take it out, but I wanted to show you how to access it. There's little tabs up there as well. You pull those tabs, there's two of them, so the top one comes out first, and then you will lift the bottom one up because it's a little bit below the deck, as you can see, and then you'll pull it out and then replace it the same direction. Bottom one stuffs down and the top one stuffs on top. All right, there you go, all that effort. And I've got some, <laughs> I got some war wounds to prove it. And that was just because I had to take out this area. All right, I'm gonna put it back together, but that is how you install, or how you would install the air filters in the Model 3. All right, everything is put back together and I only have one minor war wound on my finger. That's okay. Again, this is the Model 3 cabin air filter with activated charcoal. I put a link in the description below. I have a special discount code if you wanna buy it through my product link. Until next time, I'm Dave Erickson. Thanks for watching. Adios. If you end up buying a Tesla, which I hope you seriously consider, use my Tesla referral link to receive 1,000 miles of free supercharging on a Model S, Model X, or Model 3. There's a link below this video. It's free miles. Might as well take advantage of it.